Howdy guys, I'm back with more of The Witcher. Last time I attended a posh reception over at the new Nera Court, and I gotta say I'm not really sure who I can trust. So today I'm just going to work on various quests throughout the trade quarter, and I'm going to go ahead and start with Dandelion's loot since it's not too far from where I was. Dandelion asked me to recover his loot. Without it, he can't perform as scheduled at the new Nera Court. Apparently the loot is in a certain house in Vizima, and he's too plastered to go get it himself. I'm guessing there's going to be some monsters in here? Ooh, maybe not? Leave my daughter in peace. Ooh. I want my friend's loot. I want nothing from your daughter. Relax, I'm leaving. I'll pay you. I'm guessing I'm gonna have to pay him, which sucks because I'm broke. But uh, let's see if I can talk to him first. I want nothing from your daughter. I want nothing from your daughter. I don't believe you. Get out of my house, you blooming drifter! Listen, good man. Out! Or I'll kick you out! I'd prefer a peaceful resolution. Shove off. I've heard enough insults. I'll take you with one hand, bastard! Take that! What the heck? This escalated quickly. Oh, I'm fist fighting again. There's there's a lot. Ooh, yikes. This guy's kind of tough. There's a lot more uh, fist fighting in this chapter, it seems like. Uh, I got to fight that guy at the uh, 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 brothel, or ooh, he's gonna get me here. I had to fight that. Well, I didn't have to fight that guy at the brothel. I there were there was a different way. Just like I'm sure I didn't have to knock this guy silly. I guess I could have bribed him, but I'm poor. I'm just a poor witcher, man. Come on, you started this. Damn you! Pass then. Just don't beat me anymore. You started it. I didn't Lord, want to beat patience. you. Gosh, I didn't want to come in here and start swinging. Alright, so is the loot, er, is the loot, yeah, the, oh, I guess, yeah, the loot, not loot, L-O-O-T, loot, <laughs> whatever. Okay, so, maybe it's, oh, uh-oh, I can't go over here. Damn uh, you! Pass, then. Just don't beat me anymore. I'm in the process of doing this, if then you don't mind. Alright, there's an exit, he's bouncing on out of here, um... I suppose what I need is upstairs then. I thought this was going to have like some monsters pop out of the ground, but I was, uh oh. Ooh. Fun time with the daughter. Who are you? Uh, Geralt of Rivia. Witcher. I apologize for the intrusion. That's alright. I'm terribly bored since Papa caught the troubadour dandelion here. No one sees me. Aww. That's why I'm here. He caught Dandelion doing what? <laughs> yeah, what, what was he up to in here? He caught Dandelion doing what? He was to teach me music. One day, Papa returned from the trading post earlier than usual. Uh -huh. We were rehearsing the cantata, A Bird's Tears. Papa walked in at the climax. Uh -huh. Is that an obscene song? No, it's beautiful. Very... Poetic. Papa couldn't understand why the rehearsal was in the nude. <sighs> he was furious. He pulled an old crossbow from behind the wardrobe. <gasps> Luckily, his vision isn't what it used to be. Oh, jeez. Okay, typical angry father reminds me of the first time I brought a boy home. When I was 16, my dad, I'm not joking, decided to bring out his shotgun to polish it. It's like, really, dad? How cringy. <laughs> all right, all right. Heard any interesting gossip? Ugh. Yeah, um, that's why I'm here. Giggity, giggity, to deal with the crossbow. That's why I'm here. Why didn't he come himself? Perhaps it's just as well. You look promising, too. I'm here about the loot. I figured. Somehow he hasn't been singing love songs under my window since Father caught us. Aww. By the way, I hope you didn't <laughs> hurt Papa. Uh-oh. Uh, he'll be fine. We settled matters. Uh, he's fine. He'll be fine. He'll be fine. <laughs> Why should I give up the loot? After all... Dandelion won't come to see me anymore. Oh, she's He's gonna... like that. If I give it to you, he'll use it to serenade some other victim. 
Oh boy, this chick is complicated here. Alright, I thought all women were simple in this game, but... Alright, if you give up the loot, it'll prove he's nothing to you. You dumped him. You dem demonstrate that to your character. The beauty of your soul outshines even your rosy cheeks. Oh yeah, I got a sweet talker here. You demonstrate that your character, the beauty of your soul, outshines even your rosy cheeks. <laughs> Don't flatter me. I'm no fool. Uh -oh. The poet master humiliated me. He used me like some lewd wench. Oh, I want revenge. I want him to feel what I feel now. Oh, boy. Okay. So, here's a lesson learned. You think you can sweet talk all the women, and then you get that one that's like, nope, that's sweet, that, that poetry crap don't work on me. This is that broad. Uh, that's not really possible. If you give up the loot, it'll pre- Yeah, this, we looped back around to this. Let's go with this one. I, I think the game's trying to tell me it's this one. If you give up the loot, it'll prove he's nothing to you. You dumped him. Yes, he fell at my feet. He proposed, but I refused. Oh, it was that one. All right, I would stop short of the marriage proposal. No one would believe it. Eh, let her believe what she wants. Now, now, can I take the loot? Ooh, which one shall I have? Mm, hmm. I feel like I can get with this chick, but it can be easy to screw up. Yeah, she seems a bit more practical. Let's tell her this. I would stop short of the marriage proposal. No one would believe it. Am I not good enough for that scoundrel? <sighs> it's more his problem. If you knew how many tears I've shed for that idiot! Take the loot and go! Leave me to suffer! I can cheer you up. I'm le Oh, here we go! Can I cheer you up somehow? It's like I almost knew what was coming. <laughs> he coming. Can I cheer you up somehow? Embrace me. I heard once that a witch's touch is, um, special. Mm-hmm. All right, causes a slight tingling. Let me show you. It's a myth. I'll say. I like that. I guess you could be like a celibate Geralt if you wanted to. But what's the fun in that? Causes a slight tingling. Let me show you. Aw, yeah. Got with the. D <laughs> Poor pops downstairs is like again. Ah, oh, well, this guy kicked my butt. I'm just gonna sit here and drink. <laughs> Oh, yeah. I wonder how many encounters I must have missed by now. All right. I should look for the loot in the damsel's room. Oh, I was about to turn around and leave. So I got what I wanted. No, 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 no. I'm here for something, actually. Uh, she's, she's got some pretty strong booze in here. And, aha, Dandelion's loot. It should be returned to him since he may need it. All right, then I guess I'll do that for him. Alright, I need to get back to the new narrow court. I have another quest to go, um, this one, the blue eyes. I must prove, uh, Patrick, De De Patrick Swayze refuses to believe the girl at the brothel is his sister. I must find some way to prove it to him. I must prove that the girl from the brothel is the night's sister. I should go back there. I'm gonna do that next since it's, uh, not, well, it's, okay, it's a decent walk from where I am, but... I think I'm gonna have to eventually go back to the new Nara court for those so I can knock a couple of that out and then go back and then go to a primary quest or something. Ah, Rosalind. Rosalind. That's a pretty name. Oh my! Oh, I left her breathless over here. Alright, let me quick save here and down the stairs. I get a little nervous every time I like zone. I just feel like my game's gonna crash. It's crashed a couple of times already. So, uh, her, her dad went out, went through this door that I can't go through. Um, where does this exit go? Is it just the other side here? Let's see where this takes me. Exploration, right? Hmm. Uh, okay, it looks like it took me further away from where I want to be. Alright, well, hmm, hopefully not too many monsters are going to pop up around the trade quarter at night. I don't know if it's going to, I mean, let's see, what was it, the, the, the area next to the hairy bear had, like, vampire-like features, so, you know, I already know that I can probably expect some vampires, especially over at the brothel. So I already know there's, like, some supernatural beings about, so... 
seeing some monsters wouldn't be too much of a surprise, but I don't know, there's also like super heavily um, armored guards walking around here. No, uh, no assassins or vampires or anything crazy. Oh yeah, I need to go, hmm, I bet the person I need to talk to isn't out and about yet though since it's, ah uh, yeah, see I need to talk to that alchemist, I, I need to give him that red uh, meteor stone thing, yeah he's not here, Ooh, he's off asleep or something, day night schedule right? Kind of annoying. Like I like, I, I do like it, but it, I've mentioned this like a million times. I like it, but it's annoying. It really is annoying sometimes. A lot of guards what around here, him? around the uh, brothel here, almost in a circle. I wonder if I need uh, to be. Damn, it's hot in this thing. Even at night time, I'm gonna save. I don't know if I need to be concerned or not. I'm a little overzealous with the saving now lately. All right, House of Ill Repute. Alright, let's see, where's Blue Eyes? Blue Eyed Lass. Yes? Alright, uh, I think, ooh, before we talk about brother, oh yeah, 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 I think she costs, like, money. Alright, I think your brother may be looking for you. I think your brother may be looking for you. What? No! I have no family. You sure? Entirely. This is my home. My sisters of the night. Mm -hmm. I must be mistaken. Yes? I'm pretty sure I'm not mistaken. Maybe I need to find out something else about her. I'd like to spend the evening with you. With pleasure, white-haired one. Oh, yeah. But you must orins. first make a contribution to the House of the Night. A mere 500 orins. I wish I could... There's no way... How much couldn't we arrange a better deal? I have something. Uh, what if I have that... Oh, I didn't put it on, though. What about that one ring that I got for the... Till tomorrow. Ha! <laughs> You jest. Is it... Yeah, House of the Night Signet Ring. I should probably put that on instead of one of these junky rings. I don't know Shove if that... Shove off, bum. Oh, she doesn't like me right now. That's... I work too much. Probably not going to help because I think it was only for the bouncer. But I'm guessing the only way to spend the night with her is by coughing up the 500 orange. And I'm guessing after you spend the night with her, maybe you find something out. I'm gonna try the signet ring again. Or well, this yes. time. Alright. Um I think blah 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 blah. Let's see. Oh, I'm guessing this isn't gonna work, but it's worth a shot, right? Oh regular customer? Three hundred orange with the discount. Oh, okay, okay. I still don't have enough. See, I'm all sorts of broke. I could probably afford it if I, if I sell like a lot of stuff. Um, hmm. Here, you want some booze? Ha! You jest. <laughs> okay, okay. So that that was a bust. But I do know that the ring does something. I just need to go make more money. What? <laughs> Which um. Hmm. I guess I'll probably have to wait until the daytime when all the merchants are up and stuff to sell some stuff. Alright, so I guess I'll come back here. I can't uh, get this done right when I thought I could. So I guess I'll head back to the uh, inn and turn this in to Dandelion. And then maybe I can uh, rest until it's morning and actually advance some stuff. Uh, yeah, I guess then I'm gonna have to go back out to the oh a sal Damn, it's hot in this thing. There are salamanders out and about. Look, they just they're just wandering around like what are they doing? What are they fighting? Oh, they're fighting guards. Oh, I'm gonna jump in here. Hold on, let's let's jump in, let's help out. Alright, I think I've got my non-silver sword on already, so I think it'll I might need to be in uh Oh, I wanna try this one, I haven't really used it yet, or like very well. Let's see. Is he? You're dead. Uh oh. Did it not work? Did I? Is this the stuff? Or did I accidentally hit the guard or something? I don't know what I did. I don't think I hit the guard. All right, where's this dude? I really want this to work. Die, shit eater! All right, nope. I'm not, I'm I'm screwing it up somehow. I'm not really sure what I'm doing wrong with this spell. Gosh, this guy's... Alright, I think I need to be in strong style for him because he's not taking any damage, so... I think that's... Yep, there we go. That's much better. Um, alright. Well, 
couldn't really save the guard there. I've got quite a few of these brooches now, though. Did I hear? I thought I heard something. All right. Um, guess I'll help myself to the brooch and flower. All right. Uh, hopefully these guard. I, I'm still like worried about guards giving. Uh. Okay, they're they're not mad at me. All right. I've uh, made made a wrong turn at Albuquerque. All right. Let's go down here. Oh, more. S oh, oh. Tick that. A Kikamore worker. Oh my. There's some interesting stuff out. Okay, cat style. All right. Salamanders are definitely out and about now. Um, and now some really weird monsters. A Kikamore worker. See, are, is this any good? A Tamerian Iron Dagger. Hmm. Okay, yeah, here we go. Alright, so let me, I'm gonna try this spell one more time. Um, oh wait, no, I'm not. I'm stunned. Hey! Tip that! Wake up, there we go. Alright, can I use this spell? Oh, why can't I use it? Uh, that was weird. I still can't get it to work. Okay, I'm not really sure what I'm doing wrong with that one. Maybe I need to put some points in to get it to work properly. So I'm gonna just. I guess I'm just gonna use any, honestly. Can't it in, right? It does damage. That's all I need. It's just. I think I need to put on a silver weapon for this thing because it's a monster. Let's put that on. There we go. There we go. I don't, my, I don't know if I'm doing any damage. Doing more damage to it or not. I think I need to be let's try strong style. Oh yeah, there we go. Ooh yeah, that was easy peasy with strong style. Alright, there we go. Everything is dealt with. Ooh, uh, no brooches on this guy. Alright, finally made it to the inn. Oh gosh, just as these drunkards come stumbling out. I good thing I uh, took care of the salamanders. Don't know if the salamanders would have attacked. Alright. Let's see. Uh, Pollard's over there hanging out. Where's Dandelion? Is he uh, not hanging out here? Am I blind? Where's. Having problems, Witcher? Yeah, where's Dandelion? Actually, nothing I can't. Actually, yes. Actually, yes. <laughs> Sadly, my code of conduct forbids me from using my position for private benefit. So you refuse to help? Wait a minute. What code? Yeah, seriously. Not your business, Witcher. Oh. You BSing me, right? You are BSing me. Okay, well, this You're is different. Where's the line? Is he any chance he's upstairs? Or do I just need to wait until the day? Maybe I just need to wait until the daytime or something. Let's see. Nobleman. Oh, what was that about? Uh, Lugart just, uh, just, uh, regular. Sometimes I prefer to be a peasant. Oh. What the heck? This is trippy. Waste of words. Uh, Triss just sparkled. Witcher. Uh, okay, I guess I'll find you. I'll find you later. Hmm. Alright, well, obnoxious that, uh, um, what's his name? Uh, Dandelion. I need an apprentice. Gone off wherever. Your greetings. Person. Can I? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm here about the. Let's see. Um, I need something. Nasty day. I guess I should probably sell these salamander brooches. I'm starting to get quite a few. Alright, just unloading a bunch of junk. Sorry, sorry. Alright. And, um, room's like five orans, I guess. Your yes, greeting. Blah, Can blah, I? Blah, 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 blah. I need rest. Got a room? Yes, five orins. All right, that's reasonable. Whatever. <laughs> five orins to wait for the day. Oh, did I level at one point here? I wanna. Let's see. Oh, I must have leveled and forgot about it at some point, or I would have done this off camera. Oh, geez, I don't really know what I want right now. Should I put more in Igni? Let me let me see. What's this new one called? It was Yurden. Hmm. I don't know if. Hmm. I don't know if that's really worth. I don't really know. Oh no, it's Axie. Reduce. I don't know if this is worth putting points in, to be honest, but 
I'm starting to run out of stuff to put bronze talents in. Alright, so I'm wondering if I'm going to need more silver or steel for this chapter. I'm fighting a lot of salamanders makes me kind of think I should do steel for a silver talent. But, I don't know. This, this is pretty good too. Hmm, let me, let me just take a quick gander through here. Hmm, more, more dodge might be good, but maybe later on. Hmm, endurance. Ooh, do I want more endurance regeneration? That seems kind of like overkill. 50%? I could use a lot of Igni. You know what? I'm going to get that. And I'm going to probably maybe put more, my next silver points in more and more Igni. Ooh, especially that causing fear. Ooh, I could just be like some god of fire or something. <laughs> All right. Um, well, what should I get then for bronze talents? Um, I think I'll grab this. I'm, I'm feeling like I'm getting a bit more comfortable with group style for silver. Not really sure if I'm going to need group style f as much for steel. Uh, let's, let's, eh, there we go. Good enough. All right, now meditate. I like meditating till like noon. Because it seems like a lot of people are just mucking around in the early, early morning, and it's hard to get stuff done. Heck, I was hoping to have more quests done by now. You fight All right, the there's Dandelion. All right, I'm on the right track now. All right, quick save real quick. Quick save real quick. Yep. All right, got your loot, my man. Gerald. Uh, here's your loot. Here's your loot. Great. I owe you yes, one. Yes, you do. I need to prepare. When's your performance? After eight at night. Come if you want. Oh, if I can. If I can. All right, I guess I need to be a little aware of the time. Because, uh, I've got a, a performance to go watch in eight hours. So did he not give me any money? Man, being a witcher sucks. <laughs> I'm just running around broke the whole time. Alright, so I wanna, I gotta remember, I wanna go into the workshop because that wasn't a quest and I feel like I'll forget about it if I don't go do that, like, ASAP. So I'm gonna run oh, back over to the workshop and trade in that, like, red stone to that alchemist to see if I get anything exciting. And then I guess I can get back on the main Those quest because I'm too, so or well, one of the main quests because I'm too broke to spend a night with Patrick Swayze's Ooh. sister, which might be a good thing. I don't know if he's going to like me banging his sister very much. I think brothers tend to be kind of sensitive about that for some reason. I'm not sure why. I mean, you know, she's an adult. It's her body. She can do what she wants. All right, here's this dude. Still here? All right, uh, I don't know how to get back to that thing where I could trade to him. What do you do? I'm developing a Philosopher's Stone. Ah, here we go. I'll share with you the gold obtained from the transmutation of lead and throw in free the guarantee of eternal youth. Um, let's see, seriously, in that case, um, hmm. In that case, I'll return soon for my cut. Oh, well, that's not what I wanted. Still, Still here, yeah, yeah, yeah. What, what do you do? I'm blah, blah, blah. Oops, seriously. Serious. I'm from the University of Oxenfurt. They hired too yeah, brittle yeah, to yeah, expect. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Uh, jeez, I thought I was supposed when we to... I attempted to solve the riddle of... Like what? Red meat. Here it is. Okay, here's where I need to give him the red meat. You're right. Here you go. Ah, the ore. Perhaps I can finally cause this reaction. Good luck. Oh, sorry. Here's the book. Thanks. Still here? I'm done. Thank you. Bye. Let's see. What do I get? Received. Uh, I already read this. Okay, so I should maybe put off on the. Oh, well, that was a waste. On the uh, buying of books in a new chapter because it seems like a lot of them are obtainable by other means. I feel like I've just been swindled. I think the meteorite was worth more. Ugh, now I feel bad. All right, well, still can't afford to spend the night with blue eyes. I can go talk to Jethro. I've got like a lot I can do right now. Um, I can go to speak to Vasca in the swamp. I'm gonna not do that for a long time. Uh, I should, okay, I think I wanna do this actually. I think this one is pretty interesting. I need to go take the source child from the hospital and bring him to Triss. 
and it's on the way, it's just right over here, so let's turn and go that way. I feel like Shawnee's going to be a pain in the butt about it, though. Just what Shawnee's we needed. Shawnee's kind of Rain. consistently been a pain in the butt for a while. I'm not really sure if I like her or not anymore. Like, I want to like her, but she was kind of a brat in the at the end of the last chapter, so having a hard time figuring out how I feel about Shawnee. And now I'm having a hard time figuring out how I feel about Triss. Like, on the one hand, she's saving me. But on the one hand, I feel like her and Lou Varden are up to something. I mean, I don't know. Redheads are trouble. I just need to find myself a nice brunette girl. That's what I want. I want a nice brunette. I can... Oh. Why were you in that witch's house? What? If not for Triss, I'd be dead, most likely. I'll show you my other, less tender side if you're lying. Okay. Ah. What brings you here? That witch is trying to steal one of my patients, Alvin. What does that hag know about raising children? Everyone knows she can't have her own. I don't want her handling that child with her dirty paws. Devil only knows what she wants with him. Explain to her that Alvin's staying with me. Oh. It'd be much simpler if you two would just agree. Simple or not, yes. you know her better. Please bring Alvin to me. Oh. Okay, give me a kiss. What? 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 <laughs> I'm so... No, 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 like, I feel like my head's spinning. She comes at me... Bah, 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 bah. Okay, give me a kiss. Now I'm just like... Is this how it feels to be a man? Like, guys? Are all this ladies Something this must psycho? Be done about that. Did we really run that hot and cold? I apologize on behalf of all women. I am so sorry. I didn't know we were that bad. My, my bad. I'm sorry. I know I've done... I know I've gone crazy on someone and then turned around and didn't sweep the next minute, so... And now I know what it feels like to be on the receiving end, and I'm just sitting here like... What the fuck did I do? Yeah. <laughs> Greetings. You don't have anything new to say. Nope, didn't think so. Farewell. Alright, so do I have a choice in who to bring the child to? Alright, when I left... Ooh, where is it? Here we go, the source. When I left Triss's, I ran into Shani. She claims Triss has dubious intentions toward the child. She asked me to bring the child to her. The boy is at St. Labiota's Hospital. Shani wants me to take the child from the hospital. So do I even have a choice? Like, could I pick between bringing the kid to Chris or uh, Shawnee because obnoxious as Shawnee is I do trust her like she's obnoxious but I don't feel like she's a bad person like I feel like uh, Tris isn't really a bad person either she's really you know helped me a lot and I've even helped her like right at the beginning of the game but I don't know I've just got like some bad bad feelings about her since that party I don't I can't quite shake it you know or not even the party but like the beginning of the chapter oh Carol hey. I was looking for you I had no idea nurse Natala was such a wellspring of passion you, dog. you ever seen her leaning over patients <laughs> those eyes dandelion <laughs> uh, in any case I was on my way here to entertain Natala with some scintillating conversation when I passed these two odd-looking men dragging out this kid who was hollering and crying. Oh, great. They called him by his name. I think it was Alpin or Albin or something. Alpin. Shit, that's who I'm here for. Well, you'll be proud of me. Oblivious to any danger, I decided to help the kid and followed them. They dragged him to this house. You're right. I am impressed. Told you. You have to take me with oh, you this great. time. This is true ballad material. <laughs> Matter of fact, I'll lead you there. The house is in the non-human district. Follow me. Oh boy, it sounds great. Dandelion is the sidekick I didn't even know I wanted. Well, I'm, I'm, this is pretty scene. okay. I'll, I'll, I'm, I'm kind of curious uh, which of us has more notches in our belt. <laughs> I really am. <laughs> I feel like we probably compete with each other, or we probably did in another life. Alright, so am I actually supposed to be following him, or do I just... Uh-oh. I ran ahead of him. Oh, there he is. There he is. I think I actually... Alright, I'm gonna save again. I know it auto-saves me when I leave zones. I'm just... I'm just really spazzing out lately about the saving because of a few crashes that I've had. Alright, I love his little goofy run shuffle here. Almost there. Almost there. Almost there. Is this it? Geralt, hurry! Alright, yep. Oh, I, I, I tapped W and entered a cutscene. This is where they brought Alvin. Alpin. Great. Wait here and don't enter until the fighting stops. You always tell me to wait outside. No. This time I'm going in with you. 
I'll create a new genre. The proactive ballad. <laughs> I don't want you around when I start swinging. Yes, I do. Okay. I guess poetry requires sacrifices. Oh, I, I could use a bard for some buffs. All right, so I guess I'm going to have to whip out the uh, steel sword. You know, I have like a thousand of the... Well, not a thousand. I have eleven, clearly. But uh, should I... I should probably just go ahead and actually use one of these. Uh, let's see. I'll, I'm going to probably end up using this. So let's go ahead and get it all shiny here. There we go. How long does that last, anyway? Or, uh, I thought it was a buff. Is, is it not a... I thought it was a buff. Is it permanent? Or... Oh, no, okay, yeah, applied oil. Never mind. 15. Okay, it lasts a wow, it lasts a long time. Quick, Geralt! There's no time to lose. I didn't realize they lasted so long. I should have been using these a lot more. Alright, in I go. Kidnapper's hideout. Oh, assassin. Alright, they don't Take that! Oh, I'm using my oops, I'm using the wrong weapon here. There we go. Let's switch a little bit faster and let's switch to strong style, it looks like for these guys. Ooh, oh, no, oh, group style. I got four here's my, here's my big shiny igni and ooh, that 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 regeneration dough. Here we go. Alright. Yeah, this is this this group style thing is working out really well. Really well. Oh, wow, I love that I'm just, like, destroying people behind me, I'm just... Yeah, yeah, Dandelion would have got hurt if he came in here the way I'm flinging my... Oh! I'm glad you're here! We keep Everything running. will be alright. We keep running Are they dead? Other. Yes, Alvin. They gave me no choice. I understand, Geralt. Take me away from here. Alright, can I just, like... Alright, I found Alvin... Oh. Whoa, that's a lot of blood. Geralt... And here's the boy. See? Where would you be without me? Upgrade. Shh. They're coming. Grab the kid and go out back. You heard them outside? Amazing. Okay, I'll take them. But where? Oh, snap dog. I have a choice. Take him to Shawnee. She'll know what to do. Triss will be pissed, but I can't worry about that now. Take him to Triss. She's a sorceress. Oh my gosh, what do I do? Oh, this is kind of agonizing. I'm really not sure who I can trust here. Like, um, I like, 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 I like Triss. She's helped me a lot, but gosh, you know, that very begin. I'm just not real. I'm just not sure if I can trust her after seeing that, like, whole beginning of this chapter, her talking to the mirror and something about that lizard pet. I, I think I'm putting too much importance on that. I th I really feel like I'm, I feel like I'm, I'm looking at the wrong things. Like, um, chapter two sent me for such a spin with the whole Raymond thing. I'm like, I'm having some serious trust issues and Triss has kind of been out of the picture for a while. Like, I vaguely remember her for, from Chapter 1, but I honestly feel like I know Shawnee a bit better after the party and everything we've been through. Me as Geralt that's existed from the beginning of this game with amnesia and no recollection of the past, I personally feel a bit more of an attachment to Shawnee, and even though she's kind of being obnoxious, I almost feel like they're kind of making her obnoxious on purpose so that you pick Triss that you're more inclined to do that but I'm I feel like I trust Shawnee I, she has no reason to she has like no ulterior motives where Triss might have ulterior motives I'm pretty sure Shawnee doesn't so I'm gonna go with Shawnee take him to Shawnee take him to Shawnee she'll know what to do Triss will be pissed but can't worry about that now whatever you say but I'd avoid angering a sorceress if I were you get going okay I'll leave the boy with Shawnee Let's see. I asked Dandelion to take Alvin to Shawnee's. I should talk to her, see how they're doing. I should see Shawnee. Now, is she going to be at the hospital, or is she going to be at her house at this time of day? I'm feeling pretty good about my my choice. Oh, ho, ho, ho. I'll kill you! Oh, okay. I guess Geralt wasn't lying about hearing more of them coming. There actually were more coming. I'm feeling pretty good about my choice. I mean, yeah, pissing off a sorceress can be... Well, are y'all all gonna come together or what? There we go. That's what I was waiting to do. They were coming together, so... Die, I just, I'm just not really sure, like... Yeah, pissing off a sorceress definitely is bad, but I just, I don't know. I mean, like, this kid keeps reappearing. He's obviously important. 
out. He's obviously got some kind of power, and I'm not really sure if I want to turn that power over to a sorceress that, I mean, but, ooh, fist tech. I'm not, I mean, I don't have any reason to not trust her, but I don't know, man. Just, after, like I said, after seeing that house and hearing her talk, and I don't know, I just, I've had more experience with Shawnee. Ooh, I'm just agonizing over this. I really am. I'm... I'm really feeling okay about it. I think I made the right choice. Let me save again. I know I'm being such a spaz with the saving. Okay. All right. I'm surprised nothing jumped at, uh, jumped me when I walked outside here. It seems like every time I step out outside a door, something happens. All right. It's pointing me to Shawnee's house. So I guess even though this isn't the time that I think she's at her house, God she might be. Me. I mean, it's a new chapter, so. Um, maybe she doesn't follow her same habits as chapter two. I don't know. Only one way to find out. No need to worry about the grandma boss anymore, at least. Ah, I just had to enjoy. I had to take a deep breath and enjoy. No horrible grandma. You, baby. <laughs> uh, oh, I had that little sparkle thing happen again. Own some junk I don't want. Oops, and then I clicked on it again because I'm a spaz. Alright, uh, anything in here? A lot of grandma's pickles and lard. Pickles and lard, perfect with alcohol. Yuck. Poor grandma. All of her, all grandma's cordial, all probably kicks like a meal. I'm just taking all of grandma's old stuff here now that she's passed on. She doesn't need it anymore, right? That's a terrible thing to say. Here's a cabinet. Oh, Grandma's diary again. Um, Alright, I guess I could always use a second copy of her diary. And have I gone through this? Alright, more f uh, food. Alright, well, I don't. Shawnee's probably upstairs, but I'm gonna spend a moment here with uh, my boy Alvin. Hey, how, how what the heck's been up with you? I want a puppy. No, not now. You, we can't have a dog the way we live. You'll get a dog someday, I promise. Oh, man. I feel like the, the, since the kid's got power, he's accidentally going to end up turning the puppy into, like, a friggin' Cerberus or some kind of wolf beast thing. Uh, he's been through a lot, though. You gotta you got promise a kid a puppy. Someday, dude. Someday. You'll get a dog someday. I promise. Just don't turn him into a thing, alright? I'm gonna be a witcher when I grow up. No, you're not. Alright, let's see if Shawnee is upstairs then. Hopefully, please be upstairs. Please, she is. Ooh, I'm gonna go through her stuff again first, though, because I'm a kleptomaniac. Uh, kleptomaniac. Oh, a silver necklace. Don't mind me. I'm probably gonna end up, like, re-gifting her her own stuff. Wow, everyone's stocked up on grandma's booze here. Bunch of vultures. Alright, hi, Shawnee. It's all well, Geralt. Maybe. Uh, is Alvin safe? Is Alvin safe? Yes. Dandelion brought him here and explained. I'm proud of you. I knew I could rely on you. I'm delighted you brought him to me. One last matter. Return to that sorceress and inform her the child stays with me. Oh, Finish boy. the deed once and for all, if you please. When you return, I may well show you some of my own magic. I already seen I... Well, if I must. All right, I'm on my way. I knew I could trust in you. I've given a lot of thought to the future. To us. Uh -oh. Mm-hmm. Shani. Unlike that witch, I can't read your mind, so if you have anything to tell me... Shani, I need to think. I'm not normal. Uh -oh. Stop playing the alienated mutant. I hate that. Take some time to think. And when you decide, you can give me a symbolic gift. Say a ring. Oh, Shani. No gift will also mean something. I'll be waiting. I love you, Geralt. Whoa, 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 I don't feel like I know you that well. You love me. Hold on, girl. Hold on. I'm still out here. Like, this is only chapter three. I got a whole slew of other women I want to be banging. So if I give her a ring, does that mean my banging days are over? Man, I've got like a million rings, too. A gold diamond ring. Here I don't even need that crap. I can give that to her. I mean... Do I do it? I mean, this probably isn't like a willy-nilly decision, but she did say that not giving her something is also a decision. 
but does that mean my banging days are over or is she the kind of chick that's like okay with like an open relationship because I, I got needs I'm a witcher you know I mean oh man do I do it man the thing is like that's not what I wanted to click on the, the, the thing is is like shiny 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 I love you but I already I already I already got that booty right there like you you're nothing special now okay <laughs> I know I'm terrible, aren't I? Alright, well, let me quick save again. This is like the 90th time I've done it, and... I'm happy you and Alvin get along. He treats you like a father, you know? What? He does? Man, uh, what, one minute I'm out banging waitresses and behind old sheds, the next minute I'm saddled with a wife and kids. How the heck did this happen? Alright, I have something for you. It's gold and diamonds, everything that a woman loves. If you dislike it, you're, you're, I don't know what to make of you. Here. Geralt. It's beautiful. Just like it's you. nothing compared to you. Oh. I was hoping for an amber and silver ring. Proof of love, not riches. Uh, uh, silver. Would she say silver and amber? I think I've... I probably pawned one of those or something. You're difficult. Do you have one in the cupboard I can give you, maybe? You know, she's got some... Oh, she's got some ballads about, um... About the famous bar Dandelion. Should I be concerned about this? Should I be raising my eyebrow over this? Autumn's air. Scents have pervaded the air. The wind stole the words from our lips. That's the way it must be. Please, don't shed. Those diamonds that run down your cheeks. Oh, that's so lame, dude. Chicks fall for that. That's totally lame. Alright, new gloss or destiny. The poet Dandelion contemplates whether human life is ruled by destiny. Dandelion mentions the law of surprise. When a witcher demands from a man rescued on the road that which he does not expect once he returns home, it turns out to be a child robber. During the father's absence. Wow. Witchers take the unexpected children to their fortresses and train them to be their successors. Wow. Dandelion also wonders whether love can bl uh, bind people with bonds of destiny. In no ballad does he provide a clear answer to the questions posed. Okay, I guess it goes a bit deeper than I thought. Let me read this real quick while I'm here. Elder Blood, a genetic program initiated by elven mages known as sages for the purpose of creating an extraordinarily gifted child whose power would exceed their own. According to the prophecy of the elven diviner Ithleen, the child of Elder Blood will one day save the elves from annihilation. However, the last carrier of Ayn hit Einhen Iker, Laradoran Ape Shidial, bonded with a human instead of an elf, thus scattering all plans regarding her offspring. Yikes, that screwed up stuff more than uh, everyone realized, huh? Oh, what's going on now? Uh oh, trouble, trouble, trouble. Geralt, how's Alvin? Dandelion, do you always have to butt your nose into. Action. Just asking. Mm -hmm. Something troubling you? She's just. Uh, I don't know anymore. Let's go. Can't talk about women on an empty stomach. But... No buts. Zoltan and I agreed to have a drink today. A mercenary dwarf and a wandering troubadour who knows all the loose women in town. I couldn't choose better advisors. Let's go. <laughs> and here I am trying to find a ring for Shawnee. Oh, it just okay. I don't. I don't even get a. Ch oh, I'm going straight to the hairy bear. I don't even get a choice in the matter. He's literally dragging me here. I had stuff to do. I was gonna go buy a ring for my girlfriend. Hey, Zoltan. Man. Greetings, Dandelion. Get out. Our monster slayer looks bitter. Something happened? Nothing you need to know. Geralt is experiencing cognitive dissonance, a rather unpleasant tension that accompanies the appearance of two conflicting cognitions. <laughs> Be they thoughts or judgments. Thanks. You're so full of shit, Dandelion. <laughs> Simply put, he cannot decide. I assume the dissonance relates to it. My dissonance is nothing to you. That's where you're wrong, Geralt. We're your only friends, and friends help each other. You'll see. We'll have a drink, and you'll know exactly what to do about Shawnee. Oh, Somehow I don't think so. Ooh, the vodka's nicely chilled. 
Gentlemen, cheers. Damn all dissonances. <laughs> oh, do I have to? Oh, okay. I, hey, I don't have to pay this time, but I'm out of wife's tears. This is going to suck. Ooh, delicious. Nothing like a good belt of liquor. Yeah, not bad. Incidentally, Zoltan, why are we drinking from tankards? I swear I saw glass in here. Serious problems require serious solutions. <laughs> Half measures get you nowhere. Great. I get it. Half measures for Dandelion, though. He yammers enough as it is. Will you stop whimpering like a spoiled lass and spit it out? Shani is wonderful. But? But I'm a witcher. Killing monsters is my destiny. Don't bullshit me about destiny, Geralt. I realized long ago that all those pathetic bits by Etlina and the like are the same crap and humbug as those dissonances. You may be right, but honestly, do you see me as a cobbler or a farmer? Hmm, <laughs> no. I guess I see your point. Damn it, I don't get it. What's one got to do with the other? No one said you'd have to stop slaying monsters, right? Exactly. She didn't say either way. Let me explain, Dandelion. Just because a woman doesn't say it, doesn't mean she doesn't want it. In fact, they often say they want something when they really want the opposite. This is true. I'll drink to that. <laughs> I will also drink to that. Zoltan dropping the wisdom over here. I love this. This is amazing. <laughs> Oof. Strong enough to make you cry. I'll tell you what's up with dames. You can theorize all you want, but you'll never figure out what's going on inside their heads. There's just no understanding women. Highly original, Dandelion. Sneer away, but you won't put me off. The problem is you don't know what you want. And you don't know what you're talking about. I've never had a family, but I am a poet. I know something about people. Tell me this. Do you want a family or not? Oh. Oh, Dandelion, it's not that simple. Answer the question. You know what I mean. If it weren't for this mess, Scoia'tael, the Order, Salamandra... Oh, crap. I actually have to choose. I do. There's no point speculating in O. Well, I don't know so much. I don't really see Papa Geralt out there with his little, little boy trying to teach him sword play or anything. But, um, I think a woman, but the right kind of woman that, that'll be by his side and go on adventures with him. Little, little sidekick that can, like, chuck potions at his head or something when things go wrong. So, <laughs> wouldn't that be nice? Hey, Shawnee, toss me a potion. No problem, Geralt. I, I think. I don't know, I think the right kind of woman, a kind of woman that would be okay with my lifestyle, maybe getting some on the side. Like, you could have that, like, emotional bond without the physic, like, without being physically exclusive. I mean, I'm a witcher, I got needs. I don't know what to pick. I mean, I don't know. I, I feel like it's got to be lonely as a witcher. I feel like you probably want that kind of bond, but... Not like a traditional kind of, you know, mother, father, kid, you know, family living on the, living in a house, you know, Geralt puts on his tie to go to the office. I, I don't know. I feel like, I feel like I need to just pick here in the middle. There's no real point because he is a witcher and his, he's what, ooh. Well, you know, if he did hook up with Triss, so, you know, sorceresses are supposed to be barren too. So, someone like Triss would work out for Geralt, but not someone like Shawnee. I think someone like Shawnee probably wants actual children, which Geralt can't have children, you know, biological children anyway. I mean, they could always adopt, but I don't know. I feel kind of in the middle. This is kind of heavy. There's no point in speculating. Yeah. Ha! I knew it. <laughs> don't get excited, Dandelion. I just have my doubts. Only a fool has no doubt. <laughs> Let's have another drink. I can't throw these damned hiccups. Ooh, maybe I shouldn't be buying a sh Good thing I had this talk. Maybe I shouldn't be buying rings for Shawnee yet. Ugh. I know. Let's go to a whorehouse. Make it your stag night. Okay. Dandelion, we were talking about relationships in case you didn't notice. Besides, they won't let me in. I'm a filthy non-human. Only the weight of your purse counts at the house of the night. Besides, the madam owes me a favor. Come on, Geralt, live a little. Okay, 
Yes, I don't feel like... When, I just don't feel like it. When do I never feel like it? Why is... Where's the... Where's the... I'm already out the door uh, answer. Like, my, what are y'all waiting on? Come on, let's go. Do they have dwarf women there? Glorious sure they do. It's the best whorehouse in Tamaria. So, Geralt, you coming? Mm. I'm telling you, nothing like a trip to the whorehouse to get you thinking clearly. Exactly. All right, let's go. One for the road. Gotta clear both heads or something. Wait, no. Why am I in Shawnee's house? No, that's not where I want to be. Up. Oh. oh, it's gonna make me walk to the whorehouse. Absolutely slam hammered. Oh, this game is so cruel. It really is. What the hell is wrong with this game? I really don't understand it. I'm supposed to walk all the way over to the tr- <sighs> Is Shani inside? Can I- can I get her I to- I have to water my garden. Uh, I can't walk her- I don't have any, um- I, I drank all my wives' tears. I don't have any more. I've got uh, make hidden opponents invisible. That's not going to do me any good. Uh, maybe I should take fist tech. One one will cancel the other out, right? Alvin, help me! I need to. I need time to pass like badly, like lots. Of, it's eight in the morning. Oh my gosh, what did I do? Did I already go to the whorehouse? Maybe. Oops, this is the glossary, not the um, the quests. Here we go. All right. Um, blue eyes. Let's see. Hmm. Following the thread. I should talk to Vasca. I actually don't think I'm supposed. Supposed to go to. Oh, here we go. I'm to tell Tris that. Oh, okay, I don't think I'm. At, okay, I guess the whorehouse happened. That's why it's morning. Maybe it, it already it already happened, and I just didn't get to see that little bit there. I don't. I don't know actually. Hmm. Okay. Well, you know what? Uh, since I'm absolutely ass plastered, and it's going to be obnoxious for me to walk around for a second, I'm going to pick up on the questing next. I don't really know what I'll work on next. It looks like, oh yeah, it looks like I'm going to have to go talk to Triss and she's not going to be too happy. And then I'm going to probably be heading to the swamp at some point, I'm thinking, because I'm starting to kind of run out of stuff to do over here. So, oh, well, I guess Jethro too. So I guess next time I'll talk to Triss and Jethro and, of course, sober up. Alrighty guys, thank you so much for watching me play The Witcher. I'll see you guys with another video soon. Bye for now.